Um, well, you know, they reached out to me about this project of wanting to do a two-part thing. First doing a sustainable jersey for the World Cup, and then this idea of using some of the fabrics that they've created from um, recycling former cars and car interiors to make new fabrics. And then from that, I thought, well, I would love to create something even using car parts. And so that's where the idea came from, is to create 10 couture pieces or car tour pieces um, using car parts, the recycled elements, upcycling, and creating something whimsical, um, elegant, um, unexpected together. So we work with uh, fashion designers to transform you know, automotive waste into fashion items, you know, using leftover leather or uh, wipers or maybe a uh, uh, seat belt. The most challenging would probably be the, the dress with the windshield wipers as the hem because we had to create a whole st structure under that dress to hold those because it becomes very heavy um, and to have it kind of have this shape that's kind of fluttering out that I wanted to have so it kind of was like taking like a ideal of a kind of a 1950s cocktail dress inspiration with the black velvet bustier and instead of what might be uh, ostrich feathers in like a traditional version. I wanted to use the windshield wipers as this kind of um, ornamentation. Well, I'm very proud of my legacy. Thank you so much. And I feel like it's been a beautiful 10 years and I'm very proud of the work I've done and very proud of um, the lasting images. And I am, you know, getting ready to start a new chapter. And as soon as I'm ready to tell everyone, I will, and you'll be the first to know it. Well, about two years ago, I had dinner with Angela at an Oscars Academy um, Museum dinner, and that's where we became friends, and then we started texting and getting to know each other, and then throughout this whole um, season, from the beginning, meaning the actual premiere of the movie for Wakanda Forever, I did a custom look for her for that, and then along the way up to the Oscars, I dressed her probably about five other times for different Oscar-related events. Um, uh, something for the BAFTAs as well as um, for the Costume Designer Guild Awards and then of course finally for the Oscars. So it was a great fun season playing dress up with Angela. She's such an amazing actress, such an amazing human and someone I'm so inspired by and who I love and is kind of a muse and so um, beyond the fact that that role was so strong and epic that she performed, I wanted to kind of do something in purple to create this kind of regal element because she plays Queen Ramona, so I wanted to celebrate our queen, so we did a royal purple, ultraviolet, if you will, and wanted to make something beautiful for this very important moment of her career. Smile for the camera. That's it, that's it. Yes.